In these inference questions, we have to assume that a set of statements are true. Then, using only the information in the statements, we have to select which of the answer choices must also be true. Let's look at an example. The statements we are given are The trees are all in the orchard. The apple trees are picked in the summer and no one picks from the pear trees. And the answer choices are, all of the trees are picked in the summer. The pear trees are not in the orchard. Apple trees are picked all year round. When it isn't summer, no trees are picked. And finally, trees picked in the summer are in the orchard. Now the way to tackle these questions is to work through the answer choices one at a time. You might want to read the statements first or go straight to the answers. As you practice, decide which you prefer. Starting with answer choice A, we need to assess if all of the trees are picked in the summer. Looking at the middle statement, we can see that apple trees are picked in the summer, but there is no mention of the rest of the trees, so this answer can be discounted. Moving to B. The pear trees are not in the orchard. This contradicts the first statement, the trees are all in the orchard. Answer C says apple trees are picked all year round. This answer is contradicted by the middle statement, the apple trees are picked in the summer. Answer D is when it isn't summer, no trees are picked. On first glance, this answer could be true. We know that the apple trees are picked in the summer, and no one picks the pear trees. However, always remember that we are looking for a statement that must be true, not one that could be. There is no statement that says apple trees and pear trees are the only trees in the orchard. There could be others that are picked when it isn't summer. We therefore move on to answer E. The trees picked in the summer are in the orchard. Now if we look at the first statement, the trees are all in the orchard, we can see that this answer must be correct. One general point to look out for in this type of question is the word order and placements of key words. For example, if we have the statement, only trees picked in the summer are in the orchard, and the statement, trees picked in the summer are only in the orchard, you can see that these mean different things. Examiners love these tricks, so be sure to read each statement very carefully. So, here's our summary for this type of question. Work through each of the answer choices in turn, testing them against the statements. Make sure you find the answer that must be true, not one that just could be. And lastly, look very, very carefully at word order.